the last fight that, that we were at mm -hmm. was your fight. Yep. Came to Australia to announce the that was the last UFC event you were at. Uh, yep. No, that's not true. We were at 287. I lied okay. just now. But, just but, now I lied. It's <laughs> but, what I did. But yeah, we were at 284 for the Islam fight. How do you remember these numbers, dude? <clears throat> <laughs> okay, he's scrolling through Listen, Wikipedia. man, I do this. Okay, <laughs> yeah, we were we were at that fight, and I think along with everybody else, we were a little bummed about the the decision. It was horseshit, yeah. bulk. It was yeah, horseshit. I'm hearing you. I'm hearing you. Like it's the whole thing, right? Me moving up, you know, challenging myself, wanted to, you know, have my moment in Australia. Haven't been in Australia, fought in Australia for how long? Haven't defended a belt. Haven't been able to do that, and then you know, have a fight like that. And then finish like I did, and then think like we're gonna have this fucking moment, right? Like yeah. let, let's do it. You that know, was ready it. for it, and it just taken away from me. So I was uh, pretty fucking disappointed with that, as everyone else was there. As I'm sure you would have heard. We, but, no, um, we we were, we were. Yeah. You no, know, we're not. We're not even. Yeah, I've seen, we're not seen, from there. Yeah, seen the seen, videos I, of uh, you getting, getting I, in order. As well. I was upset for a while. Mm -hmm. I have a, I have a really serious problem with judging. Oh yeah, in combat sports. Well, uh, do you have pers like a personal experience or like a personal vendetta with ju judging problems? Or I have vendettas with the refs, but <laughs> that's a that's a personal. Forget about all that. All right. Nah, <laughs> fuck you, Jack Reese. <laughs> nah, like, nah, 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 shout out Jack Reese. <laughs> Jack Reese, shout out to you because without you, we would not have Prime, and without Prime, we wouldn't have Alexander Volkanovsky. So, um, no, no, no. Isn't it just it's shocking to me how. Judges uh, can subjectively decide who wins a fight on criteria that not really is understood. Yeah, like like what? Why in that fight? Because you outstruck him, you mm -hmm. outlanded him in a massive way. Did yeah. massive? Did he come out victorious? Because even the takedowns, because he did have more control mm -hmm. on the ground, but he didn't do anything with it. Yeah. There was no damage done. So what's why? Well, that's it, right? Yeah, it goes by damage. And he obviously got takedowns, but they, he wasn't really doing much with it. So that's why a lot of people were, were pretty mad. But going by the scoring criteria, they still f believed, uh, you know, I won anyway. The, it's that 10 must system, right? Like uh, that boxing, yeah. Um, which say the second round was a close round, you know, like some people give it him, some yeah. people give it to me. Yeah. But then you've got that, the fifth round, round where five, oh, yeah. I drop him, I end up like just punching him through the canvas yeah. for the last fucking uh, minute. And that's, Scored the same. Scored the same. Yeah, that's, that's like, bullshit. you know, that he's the second round that people thought I won anyway was, uh, you know, was worth just as much as my last round. So it's just a, it's a tricky one to, to go off because you get some that are really significant rounds for someone and then one that was, you know, 50-50, we don't know. And then all of a sudden someone's winning because they had a couple of rounds like that where this guy kicked his ass for the other few as well. So it's, it's, it's a... It, I don't know. It's, out, I guess it's outdated. It, I, I think it needs so, to be 100%. overhauled. I think, I think after, this, after my, this Haney... You know, yep. experience that like, pissed me off too, dude. Haney did not win the fight, and I like Devin Haney, but he just did not win the fight, and everyone knows it. It's a, it comes down to that 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 as well. Like obviously in boxing, you got a lot more rounds, so it's you might not see it as much. As effective, yeah. but that was a good case where there were so many 50-50 rounds or very close rounds, and then there was more significant rounds for Loma, which makes you believe, ah, oh, Loma definitely won, right? Like and then you they got to go to these, oh, you know, but. And they're then 50 50s, were they just giving it to Haney? Like, you don't know. But and, again, then, and then the other factors come into play is like, yo, know, like what's what's influencing these judges? Like, and, and, you know, we don't have to get into that, but it's just, it, it feels like a really outdated system that mm -hmm. needs overhaul, especially for sports that are so in the zeitgeist and haven't had any kind of like, you know, real change. And they seem like they could be malleable. Like, it seems like mm -hmm. there could be a, 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 some sort of change affected. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think uh, I think something needs to uh, needs to happen. Obviously, it's, it's people are always talking about it. They always want to. They think they you know everyone thinks they they got the right idea for it. You know they got the answer, but it would be hard to find the exact answer. You're going to bring in something that might work here and then might not work somewhere yeah, else. Yeah. It's going to be tricky. But I mean, I feel like judging overall has to. You know what I mean? If you're you're going to go to these rounds and be like, oh, I don't know. Well, I'll just give it to him. You know, like, and then you're like, fuck, they can really uh, mess things up. But going overall, like, if you, everyone knows if that fight goes overall, like how they used to do it in other organizations or, uh, you know, in, yeah, other, even other sports maybe, but clearly you would give it to me. And everyone would be like, oh, and Alex definitely won, won that fight. But I mean, going by the scoring criteria was a bit closer, but, you know, we still think it was anyway. It also, it's a tricky one. It, it also, it is tricky. I feel like being a judge in general is probably a pretty tricky job, especially yeah. when there are close fights and, and having that much uh, pressure to 
judge it correctly because at the end of the day you're a human watching a fight real time and mm. your even position around the ring is going to change your perspective on what you're yeah. seeing um and i imagine uh, going through that loss having the uh pun intended seat belt of still being a champion yep. in in another weight class was was nice but um did you find that it was demotivating at all like was the, the disappointment strike you in a way that you hadn't felt before <sighs> I don't know. Losing sucks, you know what I mean? I don't, you know, yeah. even though uh, everyone was, you know, my stocks, you know, wouldn't have uh, declined from that. You know, obviously everyone still, uh, you know, thought I won and everyone was like congratulating me, which was, I was like sitting there going, yeah. I fucking lost. What do you mean? Like you can't, you know, they're going, yeah, but that's broken. bullshit. You know, you, yeah. you wonder it. It's uh, so it was tricky, but it did make it easier. The fact that it was uh, so close, everyone thought I won. I still had the pound for pound spot and we're probably going to do the rematch anyway. So that's what, uh, you know, that makes it easy for me. Oh, it just adds to the story. We yeah. Move on. You know, like you've got to you got to move forward, right? And just not play on. Uh, you know, obviously, it sucks. But I'll get the rematch. I'll win. And then uh, we'll make a bigger bigger fight and a you know, big, bigger ending to that story anyway. So uh, you, you, yeah. you DM me. Uh, well, we were DMing. And one of the messages you sent was uh, something like, at the end of the year, I want to have both the championship belts on my shoulder with the prime in my hand yeah exactly <laughs> i see the vision bro two two belts two primes so know, sick you know? <laughs> so sick man hey guys if you like that clip hit the subscribe button and if you want to see more zany clips click the video right here <laughs>